A coalition of election observers in Plateau State have encouraged eligible voters to participate in the coming elections. The spokesman of the group told the people to use the opportunity provided by the elections to choose leaders that will steer the affairs of the state. Bad leaders are elected by good citizens who don't vote. Nobody, as say again to the citizens of Bad State, nobody will deprive you of your right to vote when you step out, except you deprive yourself by not voting. If you don't vote, you are ignoring history and giving away your future. Our vote is precious and is the most powerful non-violent tool in our society, and now is the opportunity to use it. And so I call on the good people of Bad State to use your vote and use it wisely. We are calling every eligible voter that's of voting age in Pado State to go out and exercise their franchise by voting the candidate of their choice in the forthcoming Saturday governorship and state assembly election. Also, the national chairman of the Independent National Electoral Commission, Ayane Kufuru Mahmoud Yakubu, and his team assured Nigerians that all modalities have been put in place from accreditation to voting, count of ballots, result announcement, and real time viewing of result sheets on the INEC portal. This meant that every vote will count, unfortunately. That was not the case during the presidential election and national assembly elections. Some polling units had just one police officer to man the polling unit, while others had none at all. Likewise, there were cases of, you know, malfunction of the rivers. More importantly, in the area of logistics, there was general lateness of arrival of material, especially here in Plato State. Almost 80% of the polling units didn't get their um, uh, electoral material until about 11 a.m. on election day. That is not good enough. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.